So next is natural frequency of longitudinal vibration. Natural frequency in the rainbow, the free vibration and down frequency in a natural frequency in the barana. Okay, so any figure which to explain here. Figure le, or spring and the spring and the stiffness is small k. Okay, the spring is the mass m attached. Then mass m is the weight because delta is the deflection. Okay, so the mass is the free body diagram. In the downward direction, the mass is the weight that is mg downward direction. This weight is the opposite of the spring is the force of mg that is k into delta. In the case of the spring force, fs is equal to kx. Now, the delta displacement is the same displacement opposite in the force on the spring will develop the other so our spring force on a k into delta okay so if free body diagram which it is normal sigma f of y equal to 0 on the condition apply chamber we will get we will get mg minus e step mg minus k delta equal to 0 okay so mg equal to k delta on the ஒரு equation நம்க்கு கிட்டி இனி next நம்மல் இந்த செய்னேன் இயும் இயும் மாசின ஒரு force ஒடுக்கான that is x நல்ல ஒரு amount நம்மல் display சிதட்ட ஐன் release யான okay so இயும் மாசின வருந்த to and fro direction it will vibrate so we are considering any portion x okay that is இயும் மாச m x positionல எத்தி x positionல எத்தும் போ அம் மாசில் என்டான forces mark yana so downward direction le mg indo spring le le force na parandha k into ethra yana adha displace e dhudhu apu total displacement ethra delta plus x adha ana spring le le force inni yudha moment na arakkana arna namada newtons second law which it f is equal to m a na la condition ana apply jay and so yudha mg minus k into delta plus x will be equal to m a நான் நம்மட கண்டிஷன் இன்று இதில் நம்மலது expandிதுதும் we'll get mg minus kx minus k delta is equal to m into acceleration with respect to x நான் representயானம் that is d square x by dt square okay and நம்கு நேர்த்தைக் கிட்டி since mg is equal to k delta நம்மலி mg equal to k delta கிட்டுனாகார்னம் we are substituting it over here and from that we'll get minus kx is equal to m into d square x by dt square. Rearrange here we will get d square x by dt square plus k by m into x equal to 0. This is the equation of motion of free vibration of a body. Okay. Now what we are doing is, we will consider a simple harmonic motion. We can write d square x by dt square. This is the same equation here. d square x by dt square is equal to minus k by m into x ஏதி symbol harmonic motion we know that d square x by dt square is equal to minus omega square x so we can write omega square is equal to k by m from that you will get omega is equal to root of k by m so this omega is known as natural frequency and omega equation of another will be equal to root of k by m okay so natural frequency is equal to omega n. I will represent here. Omega n is equal to root of k by m. And since we know that omega is equal to 2 pi f. Where f is equal to omega by 2 pi. This value is substitute here. Fn is equal to 1 by 2 pi into root of k by m. This is the expression for natural frequency. Okay.